morning everybody on YouTube. Free Swimmer here. Sunday morning, early. Just got up, fixing to go run. Here shortly after coffee, just got the dogs fed. And thought I'd do a, a video. Not answering a specific question on YouTube, but a friend asked me a question. About evaporation. With the entire top of this tank open, and all of the humidity problems that I had before I learned and came up with a system to fix it. I was asked how much water do I go through? Does it, does it evaporate a lot? And the answer to that is yes. This tank evaporates a lot. I got 55 feet of surface area that's, you know, it's open and uh, I, have, I have a fan here which blows across the top of the tank and it blows to the two t to the two fans at the back window that I've designed and then I've got two fans below so between all these fans and just evaporation you know, wh whatever causes scientifically causes evaporation period you know the water coming out of the tank in the, into the air and then moving out the back window I'm going through I did a water change Friday Okay, Friday, I did the water change, and today is Sunday morning. So it's been about, about 35 hours, probably 36 hours, since I did the, the water change. And if you can see the top line, that's where, after the water change was complete, that's where the water level was in the sump. And it's down almost to the middle little white line. So... This is a 210 gallon sump, and I haven't mathematically exacted the amount, but that's right around, I'd say 25 or 30 gallons, it goes through in about two days. Something like that, because by the end of a full week, it would be, it'll get down to about here at the end of a full week which is lower than I want to go because it starts to be making a little noise from my return pump because that thing sucks like a monster. 5,000 gallon per hour return pump sucks, sucks a lot of water. So. so in a nutshell, it's probably losing 15 gallons a day to evaporation with the, uh, the ambient temperature in the house staying at a a consistent 78 with the air conditioning system and then if it ever feels stuffy at all on here this is my dehumidifier which I turn on which I have it run to a it's got a self emptying pump I have it that runs right out the back just like everything else and uh, up here across the top back those lights is where the those are on thermostats, so they come on and go off depending on the humidity. Those are crawl space fans to pull humidity out of here. And as you can tell, everything that's been painted and cleaned, it does perfect now. I'm very happy with the uh, no no mold growth anymore. Everything is. Everything is exactly how I need it so I can keep this an open top tank. And there you have it. I just was thinking about that question and I wanted to share with everybody on YouTube and do a little video, say hello to everybody, show my appreciation for everybody who's subscribed. And uh, I am out here, I am doing things. I just, I'm going to be doing a video on the motorcycle. I just did a bunch more work on my Super Glide, personalizing it, making it more comfortable. And I've got a video on that coming up real soon, but the fish are still my absolute definite babies. And this one particular guy right here. This is Chuck. I have got three chocolates. Oh, probably three and a half months now, four months now. And unfortunately, the other two didn't make it. 
He's not a real aggressive fish. Everybody kind of picks at him because he's kind of like the big oaf. They push him around a little bit. That I'm sure is going to change when he gets to be full grown, which will be about twice the size he is right now. Maybe, maybe not quite twice that size. He's about eight inches right now. So I hear they go 13 full grown. So. But he's still, he's not like an Oscar, he's not, well even Oscars aren't really aggressive with fish their own size, they're just, any fish leaves something that'll fit in its mouth, so. But like you can see, he just, he's a very non-conflict type fish, so. But he's, he's my buddy, he sees me, usually he comes out to me, he knows it's, it's feeding time now, so. Alright everybody. Any questions or comments, I'd love to hear them. Appreciate everybody hitting that sub button. Have a great rest of the weekend and awesome week coming up everybody. Later.